What up, HyperChange? Welcome to another episode of Moonshot Monday. Today, I'm gonna pitch a tiny acquisition that Walmart could make to leapfrog Amazon in the world of drone deliveries. Amazon shocked the world just a couple years ago when they put out a video for Amazon Prime Air, the drone delivery program they've been working on that in theory will be able to use autonomous drones that are electrically powered to deliver packages to you in under 30 minutes. You thought free, day, free two day delivery with Amazon Prime was crazy? Imagine free 30 minute delivery with Amazon Prime Air. Drones are an excellent technology for taking light packages, short distances in a very cheap automated way. And this is inevitably the future for the delivery of a ton of things. Think over the counter pharmaceutical products, Slurpees, food, any kind of small package that you could order online and that only needs to go a short distance, drones are the perfect fit for. But little did you know is Amazon is not actually the leader in US commercial drone deliveries. There's a tiny little startup called Flirty that's operating out of Reno, Nevada, that is actually the first US FAA approved autonomous drone delivery company. They ran a trial with 7-Eleven in late 2016 and did completed deliveries to over 77 real customers in just a month. The customers were placing orders through the app. The average delivery time from clicking the, the order to delivery was under 10 minutes. So they are actually doing it, approved. Customers were paying. Sure, this is only a micro scale test, but it's actually happening and it is here. But it's not just 7 Eleven. Flirty, despite being a no name, tiny little startup, actually has a few huge partnerships that they've already done beta programs with. In 2016, they announced a partnership with Domino's where they would be delivering pizzas via drone. They actually did the first successful pizza drone delivery in New Zealand and plan to be scaling that program up significantly in the next two years. Additionally, their program with 7-Eleven was a huge hit with customers and they plan on scaling that operation in 2017. Although I think it is interesting to note, I called up a couple different 7-Elevens in Reno, Nevada. None of them knew about this drone delivery program. So I don't know what's up with that. Regardless, such a young startup getting all these partnerships and executing is really impressive. Additionally, Flirty partnered with Johns Hopkins to deliver medical supplies in New Jersey. There is an unbelievable amount of use cases for this drone technology and we are just at the infancy of seeing how far this can go. For instance, with the 7-Eleven partnership, over 25% of the US population lives within one mile of a 7-Eleven. So it's important to note that even though Flirty's first iteration of their technology right now can only go a mile one or can only deliver within a mile radius autonomously, that is already a very compelling use case for a lot of different US consumers and stores. But additionally, that range is going to expand as the technology grows and they're only going to become more and more useful being able to take a bigger and bigger chunk of more and more complex deliveries. And I think it's really important for Walmart to get ahead of this trend. And that is why Walmart, which has over 6 billion in cash, could buy Flirty tomorrow in a non-dilutive acquisition of shareholders and immediately leapfrog Amazon as the leader in on US autonomous and perhaps global autonomous drone deliveries. Walmart just spent two and a half billion dollars on Jet.com. They just bought Bonobos. They bought ModCloth. Walmart has been doubling down on buying this e-commerce companies because they know this is the future. They need to be able to compete with Amazon to have similar infrastructure. And one of Amazon's big biggest competitive advantages over time is not that complicated. It's been getting packages to you cheaper and faster. And Walmart is starting to realize that this is the crux of why consumers love online shopping. That is why earlier this year, Walmart just announced that they would give free two day shipping on every order over $35. If that doesn't sound like Amazon Prime, I don't know what does. And instead of letting Amazon be the first leader here in drones, continually being the innovator one step ahead of Walmart, they could buy Flirty, leverage their infrastructure, turn all of their hundreds and thousands of superstores around the world into launching pads for Flirty these drones where they could take off and make all these last mile deliveries to customers. Either Walmart is gonna have to build out their own del drone delivery infrastructure, or they can make this aqua hire, get ahead of the game and acquire a market leader who already is FAA approved to do drone deliveries in the US. Flirty just raised its initial Series A funding round in January of this year, $16 million from top-notch investors like Menlo Ventures, Qualcomm Ventures, Lowercase Capital, and Y Combinator. I would estimate, although the company probably has very minimal revenue given they were only delivering to 77 customers in 7-Eleven last year, the potential for this is huge and they're a first mover. You know, they develop their drone in-house. This is a custom-made drone. It's electrically powered. A lot of the components are 3D printed. So there's a whole lot of technology that goes into this beyond the government approval of actually getting the FAA to say, okay, you can do a drone delivery. And these are all things that Flirty has and that's why they're raising millions of dollars. If, Am if Walmart was actually to buy them, I'd say the price would be between 50 to 250 million based on about you know an average 10X multiple of the capital they've raised thus far. But with 6 billion in cash, that's a drop in the bucket. Remember, Walmart spent billions of dollars on jet.com. They're, they're shelling out hundreds of millions for these type of e-commerce acquisitions. I think Flirty makes a ton of sense. And from an ROI marketing 
consumer happiness standpoint, this could move the needle so much more than Jet.com. Flirty is gonna be the platform that enables 10-day delivery much cheaper, a massive competitive edge in the world of e-commerce as drone deliveries get more prevalent. And I think Walmart needs to get ahead of the curve, buy Flirty, leapfrog Amazon as the leader in US drone deliveries. That's Moonshot Monday. See you guys next time. Peace.